Okay everyone, welcome to day four. Day four involves a dynamic workout for your upper body. So a dynamic workout involves a lot more movement in a variety of directions. So we're gonna work a lot more muscles, we're gonna work a lot of stabilizer muscles, and there's gonna be a little bit more explosive movements, some power, some speed involved in this workout. Here we go. Okay, so the first exercise in this circuit is going to involve a straight arm plank, which March is going to demonstrate right now. So once again, those hands are not quite under the shoulders because this one, they're gonna be a little bit wider apart. And the reason for that is we're going to involve a rotation of the upper body. And March is gonna go nice and slow through this movement so you can see that she's making a straight line from one arm to the other. So there's a shoulder rotation and that nice straight arm on either side, breathing out. She's already started a few, but we're gonna get you started right now. Let's do 10 on either side, ready? And that's.
So, you have one leg forward, the other leg back. What that allows us to do is to pivot on our back foot to snap those hips forward so we can get a really nice strong punch. What we're going to do is with our left foot forward and our arms up, we're going to do left foot forward, so a left jab and a right cross. When you cross with that right, you really want to snap those hips through. We're going to do 30 seconds on this side, and then when Marta tells us to switch, we're going to change our stance. So the other leg is forward, so then we can jab and cross with the other arms. This is also a great cardio workout. You really want to snap forward, but also think of pulling back nice and quick as well, and that's going to build up. All right, there we go. Okay, so that's the end of workout number four of seven. Tomorrow, day five, we're going to do a dynamic workout for our lower body. See you then.